Hello class, um, today's not really a lecture, but today I just want you to practice Law of Signs. Um, this worksheet should be handed out to you guys, and uh, so this video is just an announcement video. So in this worksheet, um, you're going to practice the odds, um, maybe you want to do some more evens also, but the point of this is, I mean, the objective of this is how to use the Law of Signs to find, you know, missing sides, missing angles. This first section, they want you to round your answers to the nearest tenth, so hopefully you have a calculator, or maybe you could borrow um, a calculator, work with somebody with a calculator, do the odds. The next section says to solve each triangle. This is the ones that we practiced yesterday. Um, there might be questions, I'm not sure if there are, that have unknown or error um, or undefined triangles in here. You want to do the odds or do the evens, whichever. And then um, this one says state the number of possible triangles, and this one says find the area of each triangle. We didn't do either of those. So really all I want you to focus on is these two sections right here. Um, find each measurement, you know, find the measure of what they're looking for, like AC, BC, whatever. And then solving triangles. So these two sections, um, within the 50 minutes, uh, you guys can do. Um, after this, or maybe you could watch it right after this, but I had, remember I told you I had that innovation video about 3D printers? I'm actually going to show you um, two videos. Um, one video, they 3D printed a wrench. And I know Edelin and some people said they saw this already. Um, Aldrin saw this also. And I also want to show you one, you know, what's a practical use of a 3D printer? I told you um, a lady, her, uh, I guess she broke her jaw or is fractured and they 3D printed a jaw for her and they installed it and it works. And another thing also is they went to a museum and, you know, some of the statues, some of the artwork is, the only, it's only one of a kind. And they used a 3D printer to print another statue or another um, artwork. So pretty cool. So maybe after this announcement you could watch the two innovation videos to get your mind thinking. And for the rest of class I want you to um, do these papers. Okay. Uh, do these questions. Um, for the week what I want you to do is I want you to hold on to these. Maybe you could staple all these worksheets together. And then what I want you to do is um, I'll take a look at your packet. Again I'm not gonna, I'm just checking, I just want you to practice. I'm just checking if you're practicing and practicing and practicing. Majority of your work is just on if you understand the objectives. So if you're not practicing, um, I mean, your, your grade isn't hurts, but it's going to really show up on your quizzes and also um, on your um, co-op quiz as well. And then uh, I'm going to open a discussion board on Schoology. So as we go through the week, if you have questions, please write them down on the Schoology discussion board or write down that you have no questions. Okay? Or maybe you could put someone, someone can put that I have no questions, then you could like their discussion post, and then you don't have to post anything at all. Um, but I just want you to have a running journal, a running reflection of what you understood, what you didn't understand, so when I come back on Monday, um, I could follow along and look at your discussions and see what you don't understand. The post doesn't have to be long, I just want to, you know, just some sort of sentence or two telling me, like, did you guys understand, and whatever. So, that's it for today. Um, good luck with your worksheets, and then um, I'll post the answers somewhere online so that you get on my Twitter and Schoology so you guys can follow along and check if you're doing the right thing. So, thank you for watching this announcement, and um, good luck.